example 7, the gradient function of curve that is dy dx equal to kx minus 5. You see that that is an unknown here, k. The curve passes through 2 point, 2, negative 3, and 0, 3. First, you need to find the value of the k. So to find the value of k, if you want to make use of these two points, you have to get the equation of curve y first. The reason is you have to substitute this as x and y. So let's see, we try to find the equation of curve, that is integration of the gradient function. So this equal to kx squared over 2 minus 5x plus c. So in this case, to be easier, you try to substitute the x equal to 0, y equal to 3. So x equal to 0, y equal to 3, you will have c equal to 3. So therefore now your y equal to kx squared over 2 minus 5x plus 3. You can see here, just now you have two unknown, k and c. Now you eliminate one of the unknown because you know you have c equal to 3. You left another point here, 2, negative 3. You substitute into the equation, negative 3 equal to k, your x is 2, 2 squared over 2 minus 5 times 2 plus 3. Therefore, you can find the value of k, which is equal to 2. So this is part A. The second one, you have to find the equation of the curve. You already have the answer. Why? Because you have equation of the curve. With k and c, you just substitute k as 2 and c as 3. So the equation of the curve, y equal to k is what? 2. 2x two squared over 2 minus 5x plus 3. Simplify it. y equal to x squared minus 5x plus 3. C, you have to find the equation of the tangent at the point 2, negative 3. So to find the equation of the tangent, you need to find the gradient for tangent. So dy dx is what? kx minus 5. k is what? k is 2. 2x minus 5. This is the dy dx. When x goes to 2, dy dx, that is the gradient for tangent, equal to, when x goes to 2, right? 2 times 2, 4. 4 minus 5, you have negative 1. This implies your gradient tangent equal to negative 1. To find the equation of tangent, you have to use this uh, straight line formula, y minus y1 equal to m x minus x1. And since you are finding tangent, you can put this as a gradient of tangent. So where is your x1, y1? That is this point here, x1, y1 because you are finding the equation of tangent at this point. So now substitute inside, you have y minus negative 3 become plus 3. The gradient of tangent is negative 1, x minus 2. So this will give you negative x plus 2. So the equation of tangent, y equal to negative x, 2 minus 3, you have minus 1. So y equal to negative x minus 1 is the equation of tangent.